Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Active Senior Life. This uh, senior has not been very active for the last few months, ever since the winter started here. But now I'm glad to be back outdoors, back at Mount Seymour, my favorite hill. And uh, I have a friend with me here today, a new friend. And uh, his name is Raj. So Raj, want to say hello? Hello guys, okay. what's up? <laughs> what's up? <laughs> so for Raj, this is the very first time that uh, he is being exposed to hiking in the snow. So let's see how it turns out and he'll let you know all about it i'm sure at the end of the day he is not a senior he's half my age so that's why i make him carry the bag yeah see the bag there he's carrying the bag we have completed the flat approach to the trail heads where the parking lot ends and now we have taken the mount simo trail the main mount simo trail and we'll be ascending slowly uh, up up the trail and hopefully we can get some great uh, views once we come to those viewpoints and on that side you can see people coming down the ski runs this is a very popular one with little kids so a lot of bacha party you can see there look at them skiing beautiful I wish I had learned to ski when I was that young. <laughs> but I didn't even see snow till I was 20 years old. <laughs> mm. So we are barely a few hundred meters uh, from the parking lot and we have stopped at uh, the Tim Jones Memorial. You can see it down here. You can see Tim Jones' uh, portrait there. This uh, in the summer is normally visible about 10 feet above the trail, but right now it's buried in snow. And uh, also the second peak of Mount Seymour has been named after Tim Jones because he was a very dynamic and uh, active member of the North Shore Rescue of which he was a member for many, many years. So, Mr. Rosario, let's... Bade chalo, bade chalo. Yeah, rocking. <laughs> rocking. Let's rock. We are rocking the rock. <laughs> rocking the ice in the snow. There we go. Good one. <laughs> Mr. Raj is tackling this little steep section. How are you feeling? Good. Good? good okay. Good. Let's see how fast you can go. <laughs> I'm wearing these little studs on my work boots. First time I'm trying it out, but they're pretty good. As you can see, they kind of bite into this hard snow. Not bad at all. As you can see, Raj is plodding away. I'm plodding away beside him. <laughs> ah, I'm out of breath. Ah. Haven't done this in months, but it's good to be back. So this is another nice viewpoint. You can see first peak from here. See those people going up that slope? That's called the winter route on Mount Simo. The summer route goes around on the right hand side uh, below those black cliffs but in winter you can uh, go up straight on that snow 
snowy slope. So since I'm not carrying a backpack, for me it's much easier than for Raj. So this is uh, the advantages of being older. The youngsters can carry <laughs> the heavy stuff. A little bit of down and then again we got to go up. The way they're climbing up on the skis, a technique ko kehte hai, herring bone. Because uh, herring is a fish, so the center ka bone hota hai. You know the bones are sticking out like this. Uh -huh. So they are walking like that only. So if they put it straight, they're going to slip down. So when they do this, or uh, ski ke niche ek uh, grip hota hai. Uh, which kind of grips when you're doing this so you can actually you can climb up on skis Wow it's good yeah, that's a lot of work. <laughs> yeah. call it uh, skins so very thin film hota hai. which is like a mesh यहाँ पे एक पॉन्ड होती है ऑल दिस मेल्स नो एक छोटा सा बढ़िया पॉन्ड होता है ब्यूटीफुल स्मॉल और मोर लाइक अ लेक पॉन्ड देन अ लेक सो राज इज टैकलिंग हिज वेरी फर्स्ट रियली स्टीप स्लोप सो देयर इज अ स्पेशल टेक्निक हियर ही हैज गॉट टू यूज विद हिज स्नो शूज लेट्स सी इफ ही गेट्स इट Yeah, so what you should do is with each step na kick aise see thoda sideways aise karoge so uh, you build a platform then you step up on that and then you do the same with the next leg you learn just by trial and error what's the best way to do it well, everyone has their different technique whatever works best we use Slope gets steep. Lift your toes and just kick straight into the snow. Ah, so stay up to grip till that, and then you. Or if that doesn't work, go do a diagonal zigzag. Come on, Tiger! Small leopard. 
snow leopard <laughs> See, I'll show you this technique. I mean, just watch me. Okay? I got no crampons. I'm just kicking my toes into the snow. Okay? This makes step ban jata hai. Okay? You can do this when the snow is soft. If it is hard ice, then you need those uh, crampons. It's climbing. But this may been the sea. There are your climbing boot hai na. The front is very stiff. Even if you kick, there are toes ko kuch hone wala nahi hai. Yeah, just look at this. Just stand there. See how I do it. Okay. First, I get my grip here. I go up. I just kick in. Pura pura chala gaya. Under. I step in. Because there's a step there. Sometimes it slips because snow thoda deeper hota hai, but it can be done. Oh, you're on your way down already. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> you got this. <laughs> now this is this gentleman's very first time ever. Ever up here? Up here, up anywhere in snow. Oh no way! He's from the tropics. Who? So. <laughs> your first time ever in snow? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, that's fun. So I'm kind of documenting this. Ah, have you thrown the snow yet? Uh, he'll make a snow angel. Oh, yeah. I'll make him nice. look for a nice spot. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's uh, fun. I grew up here, so I'm like, I, I don't know. know what that's like, right? So You guys are so lucky. But it's like my first time I see a palm tree, so I was like, what? Yeah. <laughs> I will enjoy. Yeah. Beautiful day. Yeah, it's a good Have a good one. So now it's very gradual and we'll probably stop there because the first one will be more than for the first day, first day, first show. Because <laughs> if we take you there, you'll be so tired. We'll say, never again, never again. Should not have such a bad experience. I'll say, yeah. <laughs> this sucks. <laughs> but you know, you'll forget the effort and the pain once you get down. And it's, uh, way down will be beautiful, yeah. I'm telling you. Way down, gravity will take you. Only you have to control your balance in the soft snow. That's it. Otherwise, it's. Oh. <sighs> Wow, spending the night up here? Yeah. Uh, looks like it. Are <sighs> night time is beautiful. Especially clear night hona. Stars with the like Milky Way. They can be pura Vancouver up in each. Clear hota they can see. You can see Stanley Park there, Lion Gate Bridge, Richmond Airport. Oh, I hate losing altitude <laughs> especially when you have to climb back up you're heading up to first peak oh, it's maybe second peak okay 
I think below the first peak on the other side there's some nice flat spots you yeah. can really camp on. I spent a night here once at uh, Brockton Point. Point, Brockton Point, Brockton yeah. Point, yeah. So many years ago. I want to do it again this before the snow disappears. It's great, yeah. you know, yeah. Clean too. Yeah. Nice. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <sighs> okay. On this kind of snow you can just let your points bite into the snow they will not slip and you just walk you don't have to make any effort to kick we're almost at Brockton Point and uh, up ahead you can see first peak which uh, you're not planning to do today I think getting up to Brockton is a good enough introduction for any newcomer or even somebody who's doing this after a long gap, long break. But me, right? <coughs> Hello. Ah, people having a great time ah, on the down slopes some of them want to just slide down on their butts almost there ah. So that is the first pump. The Khrana, the people are there on top. So the first peak of Simo. So again you have to go slightly down. Then you walk up. The Khrana path where the people have gone. Zigzag. On the snow, like a trench. So that's what you go up on. It's a, it's a long way. Yeah. Yeah, say, it will take us at least an hour or so at this rate. And uh, snow gets softer there. It's a pretty good outing. Yeah, so this is Brockton Point. This area is about, uh, I think, 1200 uh, meters. Okay, we are at uh, Brockton Point. We have finally reached this some time ago. It took us about uh, an hour and a half with uh, Raj and myself. You can see Raj in the frame as well. And you can see uh, first pump, the first peak of Mount uh, Seymour behind us. We are not planning to go there today because it is too late and uh, uh, we will be <laughs> really exhausted. And uh, you can have a look at uh, the scenery right around us. It's a beautiful late afternoon. Clouds have cleared a bit and it's uh, really very nice. And I think I may fly the drone here. Let's see how that goes. Joy, don't 
미로 속에서 마주했던 거 